All right, so about this entire Kendrick Lamar Super Bowl should be Lil Wayne thing. I don't give a damn. Now, the problem with this is everybody's saying that they should have had Lil Wayne perform his New Orleans respect, yada, yada, yada. Wouldn't we all just universally clowning that man about the way he sounded in a recent interview? Wasn't everybody just sounding like or just saying that it seemed as if his health might not have been in the best shape? Nigga sound like a frog. There's no way in the world they thought, yeah, from the last time I heard him speaking and we was talking about his voice and how he was sound like he was struggling to project. Nowhere does that say invite this man to do the performance for the Super Bowl. Oh, it's cool. We just play his music. No. Y'all too afraid of how bad Drake gonna feel when he hear that not like us dropping at the Super Bowl. It's over. I want Drake to experience the full power of nigga everybody ain't meek. Now we let you get away with the meek mess. Y'all know how it is back in the day. It might have even been your homeboy. You ever have this type of homie where somebody of very, very, very insignificant stature when it comes to like roasting or when it comes to like bodying somebody or something stands up for himself in those areas, even if it's against your homeboy and you kind of like, whoa, did he, he got at you and you still give him credit, even if, you know, he can't necessarily, you know, win this this battle. You still give him credit because you like, hey, he stood. No, nah, I, I don't care. He stood up for himself. And you do that. And this could be your best homie. You would never want to see him get whooped on or really take an L. But for this particular part, I ain't so petty that I want you to win against this dude who really look like he don't get many wins. I'm a root for him. If he start fighting back, I'm going to give him credit and clap for him. I'm not going to be seen. You know what I mean? Kind of ragging on this particular person who you not saying you pity him or feel bad for him, but it just kind of felt like we ain't all about to just be ganging up on this dude who nobody thinks stands a chance against you anyway. I'm going to be the one person that clap and let him know that we ain't just ganging up and bullying on him. But from the perspective of that person uh, who everybody might feel like is lame, if, you know, he don't know how to read the room. And I said this in a previous video. I think that being lame is the inability to read the room. It doesn't mean it's a bad thing. Maybe you just, you know, ain't socially aware as much, but you got to get that. You got to get that together. So if a person isn't as socially aware as he should be, you ever seen somebody who's like really out of touch socially and the people are pulling this move? You know what I mean? He's standing up for himself, even if it is cringe. And he's standing up for himself and the dude he's standing up to his best homie is kind of rooting and super hot fire and uh you know the little dude <laughs> standing up for himself they, oh, oh they rooting for him no matter what they gonna play their homie like he losing this battle because that's funnier some people it's just because that's funnier but still little dude gotta know how to read the room and still realize that he really ain't got no friends here that's really other dude homie and you really kind of being laughed at. So sometimes that's happening. And I feel as if that's what happened with Meek and Drake. Don't nobody really like Meek. And they felt like everybody was just going to let Drake know what it was because, dude, you got this history. Anybody could clown you. Uh, supposedly, you know, allegedly getting peed on and this, that, and the third. Anybody could really roast you regardless of your success but but everybody had more fun trolling him because it was you it's more fun to make it seem like this dude is giving you a run for your money so everybody says shoot we want to roast me and make it seem like you was the you getting body by singing nigga. that's where the humor came from but now they done pumped him up Pumped his head up. I done seen dudes get their head pumped up by these memes. Pumped his head up to where he feeling like nobody better ever say nothing to me. And after a long time, the younger people, they don't really understand that that was the premise of the joke going on. Not saying that Drake can't body nobody, but still, because he do make good music. But still, I feel like that was a part of it. And everybody ain't just going to let you ride that coattail into, in, in through every artist 
He thought he was brought to Kendrick it. He thought he was bringing Kendrick to that same playing field. And it ain't work. Go right ahead and let Kendrick perform at the Super Bowl. I don't give a damn about Lil Wayne, man. We done hurt Lil Wayne in the past. We done hurt it. And I realize I'm going to get a lot of people who don't like this video. Y'all probably ain't going to like this video. But I'm going to still ask you, like the video, subscribe, and join the Discord to be locked in. And I greatly appreciate y'all for all the engagement and even the very angry and salty comments that'll be, well, in the comments. I'm out.